Hey, Eagle Run 2-3 here. This is my review of the Cricut. Alright, so this is the Cricut 22 rifle. This is my daughter's gun, as it's in pink. Her choice. It is a smaller than youth size rifle. It is very short. There's the front sight. And my least favorite part of this is where it says, my first rifle. I asked them if they made them without it, and they didn't. All right, so here is functionality of the rifle. Uh, it's a single shot bolt action. The bolt action is not nice. Uh, it's fine for what this gun is, being that it was around 140 bucks, uh, but it's, you know, not definitely not refined in any way. Uh, it is a little bit difficult to load a, a round in. Uh, my daughter had a hard time getting it in there and there's no ramps to feed it. So you can't just drop it in there and expect it to go in reliably. Um, but she did a good job of putting it in there and then running the bolt. The bolt has where it goes to right there and then it actually has to go, I don't know if you can see, just a little bit further before it will go down. So you can't just run it up and then expect it to go down. It has to go just that little bit more before it goes down, which um, may be a safety feature to some aspect. Um, she can't really operate much of any of this without my direct uh, intervention, which I think is perfect. So uh, next, once you've got a round chambered and the bolt is down, you then have to cock the firearm by pulling back that lever. And then the trigger is, there's no additional safety other than that. Then you may pull the trigger and fire, which we can talk about the, uh, the trigger pull here. Uh, you have a, let's see if I can get it in the light. You have a small amount of creep and then a, a decently clean break. Um, so the, the trigger is actually not bad. So that one more time there's the take up and the break all right so the next feature about this gun is this locking mechanism so when the bolt is open you can push this up and a block raises up right there that brass piece raises up and renders the gun inoperable. You may not chamber around, trigger does not work, you can't cock it, you can't do anything, which I think is kind of cool. Um, if at some time I can just grab the gun, even while she's shooting, I can grab it and make sure my thumb hits that to so make sure that I that I pop that up. If, if you know if something's, if I need to intervene and something unsafe is happening, uh, I'll roll some footage of her shooting her first shot. I think she did a pretty good job. You have to have a special key to get that open, uh, which I don't have in my pocket, so that's the end of that. All right, so anyway, this was a great deal. They had them at Cabela's this summer. Uh, I think they're normally around 150, and I think I picked it up for like 135 or so. Uh, she shot it exactly 10 rounds through the gun. I'm going to clean it here in just a minute, which is not worth doing a video on because you just, you know, there's the takedown is no big deal. So, uh, so anyway, the, uh, the bolt comes out, and I've actually considered storing the bolt in a different location, um, but this gun has been in the safe, and she hasn't had any interest in it other than when we've had it out and been talking about it. So uh, it doesn't, it hasn't been, she's been very mature and and, and very thoughtful around the gun, and, and so uh, that makes me feel good. I'll, again, I'm not going to trust her to do anything with the gun, but uh, knowing that she is leaning towards the respect of firearms is definitely important. So. All right, you run two, three. If you have any questions, leave a comment. Thanks. You push this through. Remember this hand goes way up here. This here. And put your push that up. Push it. Good and down. Pull it down. It might not be. Okay, now push it down. All right, now you're ready. Okay, so keep your finger off, okay? Right. You ready? Mm -hmm. Okay, you gotta get it up high so you can see it. Look right down it. There you go. Okay. 
Okay, and shoot when you're ready. Whoa! Was that cool? You wanna do it again? Uh -huh. Okay, hang on, pull this. Okay, so in closing, I think that these single shot bolt action rifles are really the about the best way I could imagine training um, a youngster to use a firearm. They're inherently safe just because of the multi-step process it takes to even shoot it. I just uh, put a little bit of ballast all on this. I'm going to put it back away in the safe. I'm actually not going to clean it. So just put a little bit of oil on it and put it back up. So I, I can't imagine a better way to train um, or, or just let them train is kind of an over word. I, I mean, I, I guess to take it seriously would be to use the word train. So um, I, I can't imagine a better platform to do this with. Many people's first guns is a 1022, and the only problem with that is when the shot goes off, a new one is chambered automatically. So if a shot goes off in an unsafe situation, you're putting another round back in that same unsafe situation where it can be fired again. Whereas in this, the, in this uh, platform, the intentionality is on you know, the process of chambering, making sure that you're pointed in a safe direction can happen at multiple stages here uh, with different checks. And then, being that it's a single shot, you know the intention or the uh, the focus would be on accuracy uh, when you're shooting one at a time. When you're sending 12 or 15 shots down on the paper target at a time, you know you kind of lose track of the fact that oh well, accuracy can be important. And so these have this little peep sight, which I think is great to learn on. Um, she had a hard time with that. Uh, again, she's four years old. She had a hard time looking through here we haven't practiced that and when we play nerf guns and things like that in the house they don't have you know sights like this so uh, she did a very good job and I think this is a perfect gun to start really uh, uh, anyone out on this is a great first gun for anyone it's uh, it's very slow paced and it allows you to have lots of checks and balances along the way I imagine that um, it'll be several years until she's done with this um, I wish I hadn't got it pink so that it could be used for child number two, but this one can just be hers and I guess he'll have uh, he'll have his own. So the funny thing is is that I looked at these uh, when we were in the hospital. Uh, I was online looking at these um, the moment that we had a baby. So I was checking these out and wanted to see what would be their first gun and then it took it took four years to uh, till I, we were ready to go shoot. So. Anyway, I think this is a, a great first gun. I highly recommend it. And there's a couple other manufacturers that have similar um, designs, um, but I definitely recommend the Cricut. All right, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, leave a comment.